Hi and welcome back. In the last episode of the update on LinkedIn, what I shared with you is the changes LinkedIn has just made to your profile, to your news feed, to your business page. In this episode, what I'd like to share with you is the changes they made in how you post, mainly how you write an article. They used to call writing an article a post. So you would go to LinkedIn and you wanted to write an article, which is a very powerful way to communicate on LinkedIn. And you would have seen the word update, image, and post. Well, now that's gone. All there is is share an article, photo, or update, and uh, add an image, is what this is obviously. But if you want to write an article which puts your article as part of the LinkedIn news which I think is very powerful basically creates a blog for you when you write this article let me show you what you do all you do is you click on write an article and so now we're gonna go to writing an article and in this case it's very similar to before it just a couple of things have changed you're seeing these things over here these blocks so you're gonna put in a image like you did before so let's go find an image um, sorry about that, didn't mean to go um to you. And uh, so we put in an image. I'm about to launch a new television series called BizMap PTBO. So I was about to write an article on that. So I thought I would share with you how to do your own article on this new LinkedIn system at the same time. So what happens is it creates, gets, grabs for you a uh, an image, puts it across the top. Oh, that doesn't look good because it's you know cutting things off. What do I, maybe I want to click on this middle button and it centers it. Okay, that's what I want. Because I'm really, at this point, my um, a desired outcome for this article is to indicate to everyone that it's launching. Next Tuesday, we're going to have something called BizMap PTPO, uh, a new uh, episode for 12 weeks uh, launching on television, on, on Kojiko TV, as well as part of a, the YouTube channel, BizMap uh, ptbo.com which is pretty cool so anyways so now what do I do well I can do a couple different things I can write a headline which if you've listened to any of my past uh, coffee break learning you'll know the headline on Twitter and on any article needs to read like a newspaper headline have it captivating write something that will um, you know be of interest and keep it short and distinct so I may want to say uh, your title needs to be something that's gripping and exciting and not too long so I'm playing with, around with something like premiering Jan 10th new business vlog bizmap PTBO so I might shorten that and then what you want to do is you want to put in a video here or a visual impact or write whatever you like so in this case what I think I'm gonna do is put the uh, trailer we created for BizMap here. So I'm going to go to YouTube. I have just happened to be uploading the trailers to YouTube. So I'll grab the 15 second trailer. I have the trailers on here a 15 second, a 30 second. Both of those are for television. And I'll repurpose them to Twitter and Facebook. Repurpose, repurpose, repurpose. And then, of course, we have the entire uh, episode, which is going to be airing on television next week. And I'll have it uh, air here at the same time. I'm just preloading it now, but I won't have it go public until next week. Uh, every Tuesday at 10, a new one will go public. So that's what I'm telling people in this article, I hope. So let's see. So here I'm going to say I want to do, uh, add an image or a video. What do you think you do in this new layout on LinkedIn? You click on this, this little box. So that's all you do. So it's pretty cool. You can add an image. That's pretty straightforward. Add a video. I'll show you how to do that in a second. Add slides. I love this. This was there in the last version of LinkedIn. It was just there. And what that means is you can add a slideshow like SlideShare, which I really love add a link or you can add like a uh, uh, quote in the snippets. So the video, which is what we're going to add, all you do is you went to YouTube and you copied and pasted, sorry, you copied the link to your video. And now you come here and you do a control V, which is pasting the uh, video uh, link on this link. And simply you can put here YouTube, Vine, or any Motos, sorry, not any Motos, uh, Vimeos, maybe any Motos, but Vimeos and cr uh, click on enter. So then it takes a second for it to render and upload. So if you have no patience like I have no patience, you'll think, oh, where is it? There, there it is. Isn't that lovely? And so now I probably want to put some words about this new, uh, uh, new business vlog. So I'll probably go to my press release, which we just um, had uh, sent out. 
And so let me just steal the words from my press release. Um, there you go. And then we also have the, uh, the actual um, launch dates for every episode on there. I don't know what that's going to look like on um, this. I, I'll take, I'll cut it out and see. I'll do a control uh, C for, I was going to do just until here, but you know what, I'll try the table too and see if it automatically formats it for you. I have a feeling it won't, but you never know. So now I go back to where I'd like to enter this text and I do a control V and it's going to take this text and let's see, I'm going to remove some elements that do not make any sense. Um, and let's see, do 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 and goes back to the website and let's see, well, that's what it looks like on it. So I'm going to get rid of this, all of this in the bottom part here and gives me more content to share with everybody uh, afterwards. So let me get rid of this and I think that's it. So I'm thanking the people I want to thank. I want to let people know when the uh, episode is launching and where and uh, let's see, what else should I do? Let me see if you can actually tag the Peterborough Chamber in this vlog, sorry, in this uh, article. So if I do at greater, no, it's not letting me, um, so it's not letting me tag someone in the article, but you know what I can do? I can, because I like to uh, uh, support the people that support me, I can make this into a link. So I like to do that in my articles. I like to take the, per the person I'm trying to support and make give it a link back to their um, back to their sites. So what I'll end up doing is I'll go through on Peterborough Chamber, on Kojiko Peterborough, on the Muse Coffee Shop, which is our studio, and everyone that we're actually showcasing in this first episode. I'll go back to each of the human names and go back to their websites if they have a website, and definitely go back to our community partners' websites, and I will definitely go back to our um, a subject matter expert websites. And this one already goes to see the full episode here. It should already go to my um, website, BizMap PTBO, but I'm just going to make sure that it does go to my website and it does biz. Not sure what that is. Uh, oh, episode one. That's good. It goes directly to the full episode, which is perfect. Um, watch full episode here on uh, January 10th. So that's all there is to it. So in this, I have a great cover. I have a title, premiering January 10th, new business vlog, BizMap PTBO. I have a video that shows a trailer. I have um, the words and the information I want in there. And what I'm going to do is go back and actually um, add all of those links. So I'll do this. And uh, one moment, please. There, now I've gone in and I've highlighted and added the links to the names that I'd like to support by making sure that links go back to their sites. So I forgot to put in my own. I guess I should. So all, how do you do that? You simply highlight. You go to the uh, this little thing that looks like a link. And what you do is it allows you to add the URL that you'd like people to go to when they are... Um, looking for more information about whatever the per the person's name or the organization's name. Like Walton Wood Farms is the first community uh, local company that we're showcasing. They've done extremely well and I want to showcase how they've done that. And then there's all sorts of community partners who have helped them make that happen, like our Peterborough Economic Development, Greater Peterborough Innovation Cluster. And then we have people who are local experts like our accounting uh, expert on the f on the show, the subject matter expert Gwyneth James. So it goes to her company's website. And again, this probably should go to this should probably say Sophie and Drown Associates. My company's name is not Digital Marketing Expert. Anyways, thanks for pointing that out. And, um, and then it goes. It shows that it's being aired on Kojiko TV. So we have a link to Kojiko TV to our Greater Peterborough Chamber of Commerce who bought us our camera that we're now sharing and uh, Muse, who's our coffee shop, who is our um, studio in episodes two and on. So it's uh, pretty cool being in a funky place. And this is the uh, what the studio looks like when we're now in a Muse versus what it looked like when it was in my boring office. Anyways, pretty excited. And um, 
So that's how you do it. And so now, so at this point, there used to be a place at the bottom that you entered tags. Now I don't see them. Do you see them anywhere? Let me see if I did another box. It's going to put it at the bottom. Nope, I don't see tags anywhere, so I'm going to get rid of that. Hmm, I do not know. So more. Nope, the tags I thought were for um, helping your um, article get failed, but I don't see them. They used to be at the very bottom. They're gone now. And uh, so let's just press publish. So that will, uh, at this point, what you're able to do is uh, turn it into a post. So you're able to say something intelligent about the, um, the, the, uh, so what I've decided to say, I'm going to take that article and I'm just going to publish it as a post to my human self because I'm writing it as my human self. And then what I'm going to do is probably share it on my business page. And um, I have this article, it's gone out to the press and it's gone out in shorter form on Twitter. It's gone out in uh, medium form on um, Facebook. And now I'm creating an article to have it live on LinkedIn as well. So very excited, very excited, very excited, very excited and humbled by all the support for my new TV series and business vlog, BizMap PTBO, launching next week. Read all about it here. Read all about it. Uh, it's PTBO's new um, vlog, business vlog series. Uh, set to inspire and inform local business owners uh, on how to grow their businesses right here in Peterborough. Live, play, and prosper. Love it. There you go. Publish. So that's how you now create your new articles on LinkedIn. So this is what it ends up looking like. You can edit it, of course, at any time. All of your articles you'll find right there. You can go and look at all of your articles. And there you go. So I hope that was helpful. I'm going to like my own article. I can share it if I want to. Uh, I can look at the stats afterwards, come back and see how many people have looked at it. So if I was going to share it, it's going to let me share it on LinkedIn, on Facebook, or on Twitter. But that's all for now. That's all she wrote. Enjoy. Take care. See you later. Hasta la vista. Thank you.